I'm here today, I'm going to show you how to throw that nice tight spiral. First of all, you want to get a good grip on the football. You want to lead with your elbow. Get that finger down, thumb down, and follow through, and you complete every pass. We're here with head football coach Bob Toledo. Coach, congratulations on two consecutive New Year's Day Bowl appearances. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, I also appreciate the band. Uh, the band's been a, a great friend of ours of the football program. Uh, they come to our junior day. We've had a lot of successful good players. They're always uh, around uh, with us, and uh, you know we really have a, a great, great friendship. Coach, do you have a favorite song that the band plays? Well, I like Mighty Bruin. We score a lot of points when we play that song, so uh, hopefully we'll be able to uh, hear it an awful lot this year. All right. Coach, thanks a lot for your time. Well, thank you. I appreciate yes, it, and uh, good luck to you all, and we hope to see thanks a whole a bunch of you good this next year. You. Thank you. Welcome to legendary Poly Pavilion, home of the UCLA Bruin basketball team. Today we're playing Washington in an important Pac-10 matchup. By being a member of the marching band, you can also be in the varsity band, which plays for men's and women's basketball, volleyball, baseball, and many other events. The band has the best seats in the house, and complimentary tickets are often available for your family and friends. And during the NCAA tournament, we take a pet band along with the team. In the past few years, we've been to St. Petersburg, Atlanta, San Antonio, Seattle, Detroit, and New York City. And on these trips, we fly on the team plane, stay in nice hotels, and get seats right on the court. It looks like this year we'll be traveling to both the men's and women's NCAA tournaments. Here we are with Coach Steve Lavin of the men's basketball team here at UCLA. Coach, what does the team look like next year? Well, we returned 13 out of 14 players, and so we'll be a very experienced team. This year, we're the youngest team in the history of UCLA and the youngest team in the nation. Uh, but I think the fact that we're returning so many players from an NCAA tournament team, a team that won 22 games, uh, bodes well for our future, not only this year, but the next couple years. If Baron Davis goes to the NBA, uh, then we'll return 12 of the 14 players, and we're still this month looking to recruit some players. But even if we don't sign anybody this year, uh, we're in good shape for next season. I see. So uh, what do you think the role of the band is at the basketball games here? Well, the band has the ability to generate a lot of enthusiasm. I think the band has a contagious or an infectious uh, nature in, in that they get all the fans, uh, our alumni, our boosters, and including our players excited uh, about Poly Pavilion. And, and it just creates a great environment or climate to play in. And um, it's great when they travel with us as well, uh, especially over to SC and in the NCAA tournament. It's nice to have the band behind you. So. I know that we really respect and appreciate the work the band does. Okay. Thank you, Coach, for your time, okay, and good you. luck next year. Okay, thank you. Go, go, go. Hi, I'm here with Kathy Olivier, the head coach of the UCLA women's basketball team. So, Coach, you had a great season. Why don't you tell me about it? Great season. Uh, we won the Pac-10 championship for the first time in Pac-10 history. We went to the Elite Eight, and uh, we had a lot of support from uh, the students, the band, families, friends. It was great. And the band loves coming to the women's games. The band is into it. The band has a lot of enthusiasm. They're fun. They um, play their music, and they're so they're just so supportive. We, we love having the band there. They're a big part of what we do. Well, great. Thank you. Thanks.